Yo, so what y'all think about this Cat Williams situation? So he's talking about, in this video specifically, he's talking about how, you know, Kevin Hart was on the grind for all those years. And the only reason why he reached the level that he reached was because um, he's a plant. Basically, he got assistance or basically, um, like he said, his success is not organic. I'm not going to lie. When I started looking into like the, the social media um, influencer culture I, and I got around some social media people and I hear all these different things about the industry we all do is all over TikTok, is all over YouTube, is all over Instagram. Um, when I hear about these things and I'm outside, that's why you probably hear cars, but I hear all these things and you just see everything being exposed and you kind of like connect the dots on top of the fact that him coming out saying all this stuff and you know, truth tellers always, you know, I'm a truth teller myself with my narcissistic family system, but truth tellers always get scrutinized and, you know, there's always a bunch of people on this side or that side, whatever the case may be. But um, I, I'm not going to lie. I low-key believe what he's saying. I low-key believe what he's saying because just because of, just because of all the lies that we've been told for years and years that are being exposed. And I'm not saying that Cat, I mean, not Cat Williams, Kevin Hart doesn't deserve um, where he's at. I just think that, like Cat Williams said, it's not as organic as you think. It's not like he just blew up and uh, they both were at the same level at some point. And then um, I'm saying hypothetically, and then uh, Kevin Hart is just better than Cat Williams or something like that. And in regards to who's funnier, that's subjective. That's based off of somebody's personal opinion. I'm not gonna lie. I believe that a lot of, uh, is a lot of truth. Um, within this interview now he probably was some of the things he probably you know sounded a little off um but he's an entertainer so of course he's going to sound sound like some stuff are uh over exaggerated you know what i mean but i don't think this makes like kevin hart a con artist or i don't think that this means that he's not talented it just means like in reality it, it kind of highlights the reality of the industry or the reality of uh um success and, and you know if you don't got if you ain't got somebody to piggyback off of or if you ain't selling your soul, whatever the case may be, you might not never reach the level of these iconic people. And if you do reach that level and talk about it, they're going to tear you down. And I think that's what he was basically saying in this. Cat Williams is like a godly individual, not in regards to all these people in society, following religion or whatever the case may be. But I think that um, those who get it, get it. But I think that um, he's not targeting Kevin Hart and all these people. I think that they just so happen to be the faces in the seats of the individuals that he needs to expose if you get what i'm saying so it's not personal it just is what it is